talk yet. They're trading shots. And they're trading shots at a wildly entertaining rate. This party started 12 rounds of boxing. This is in the featherweight division. His professional record, 20 victories in 21 bouts, including 10 knockouts with only one defeat. The reigning and defending NABF champion, Robbie the Bomber, he weighs 125 pounds. In 39 professional bouts, he has 37 victories, including 29 knockouts and only two losses. And Manuel Marquez! Punch Robbie Peyton never delivered as far as the sport is concerned was the one in a sparring session with against Marquez after all Barrera's the best fighter in the division Marquez's career has been more or less mired in neutral it's another chance for him to step forward so he should be in good shape well and he's been very generous to Pete and Pete has been very so crafty fighter very smart very crafty and in Marquez you have a very and roughhouse style of talk in bad position which make it very difficult to land a Pete Barrera and Morales has to be bad there's a fix in economic force again as soon as he's out. Given the profiles of the two fighters, Marquez, he's got to get inside. Macho Berenstein has did a great job, I think, in training both of the Marquez. So too many of the Mexican left hooks to the body. As he has now shown he can win without that. They continue to trade from this distance. Marquez seems likely to land more, half a foot closer. He goes right again. with the jab and the occasional right hand. There's a right hand. On his right hand. And he's landed him at will with the low left hand. Heat of the battle. He's coming in and still is getting hit with those right hands. But maybe over 100, maybe close to 200 pounds of the fight. And as a result, those habits that he's developed is going to be very hard to see that much of a problem. But uh, with a puncher like Marquez, who's also a sharp fighter. In to take good stuff for Juan Manuel Marquez. The bad news is that Marquez is landing good stuff. Crowd here watching this fight as they get ready to change of the opportunities presented to him. Emmanuel, what can Peden do to change the fight? Lacey works with uh, Keep the Robbie Peden. Keep the blows up. That's the second time. That's a warrant. Keep the blows up. You understand? Pernell Whitaker. Yep. Some of the other fighters too. Is an Hard right hand by Marquez. Keeping the elbow straight when you jab, huh? That's very true. Keeping all those right hands that you saw in the replay package, and there's another. I don't recall him. The big brother. Get. You leave in yourself wide open to get caught with a counterpunch. Just beat an uppercut when you shoot as a lead punch. Yes. Momentarily snapping Steven's head back, and now combination punches. Right hand landing flush, swelling around his eyes and the rest of his face from getting tattooed with all those punches Marquez lands. There's a slip as Marquez goes down, but maybe a little bit of a confidence builder for Pete. Yeah, I think it was. Is for a right hand. Some guys roll the shoulders when you shoot a right hand. Some guys rob Marquez of any confidence. It's easier to count the ones that he blocks than it is the one he does. Okay. Them later in a fight, it may slow him up. I don't know. So Great combination. You turn with about 12 big punches together. All of them combinations. From Marquez's nose. Yeah. yeah Marquez said that the, the fight has been. Just range well, so be it. And is uh, the undisputed. Uh, I don't really think he's become, uh, you know, Pittsburgh. Robbie Peaton trying to make a fight of it against him. I mean, you'd have us all trying to get him with those right hands like that. He would, he would push his left hand out and use it. Through nine here. Trying 
trying to close the show as better in certain rounds than he did in other rounds, so he didn't get hit that much, but he took off the last three rounds. And Doreen kept fighting. And if you're a fighter, just take off and quit fighting at a certain point. And one thing Peden has going for him here is that Marquez has hit him a lot, but clearly Marquez has been able to discourage him. Yeah, Marquez has hurt him sometimes. <laughs> They're going to stop the fight as Rocky yeah. Peden throws up in his corner. You saw him vomit into the bucket, and you heard Roger Bloodworth say, you can't fight like that. Technical knockout victory for Marquez extends to seven. The current knockout streak puts him in position for a title shot against Manuel Medina for the belt that Medina holds. In